It's sponsored intro time. Head over to RL Exchange where you can buy all your favorite Rocket League items. I mean, <laughs> look how crisp that looks. And you can do this on a bunch of different consoles. You can use a bunch of different payment methods and your items will be in your inventory it's super fast. It's super simple. And you can use code Dillbobs at checkout for 3% off. Now let's get on to this video. Yo, what's going on guys, Dillbobs here. This video, I'm going to try and keep it quick. I just want to let you guys know that the ice charger is definitely coming back to the item shop as a DLC at some point soon because the rarity of this car was recently changed to import before. I'm pretty sure it was premium or legacy, one of the two, because it was a DLC. But if you notice, when DLCs come back to Rocket League in the item shop, their rarities are never premium or legacy. The rarities are very rare, import or exotic. For example, the Nissan Skyline. That is now an exotic rarity. So as you can see, the ice charger was changed specifically in the last update to an import body. And they'd only do that if they planned to bring it back to the item shop in a DLC. So look, this is the ice charger. It looks freaking awesome. Since we got the Nissan Skyline back, people really wanted the ice charger. Um, but yeah, I can customize it with, you know, all kind of decals at the moment. I don't know if that will be the case if you actually end up buying it from the item shop. But I mean, this thing looks pretty nice. And if you're a fan of the ice charger, then you should probably get your hopes up because I'm 99% sure that this will hit the item shop soon. Now, please don't bug me saying, what date is it coming out? Obviously, I have no idea. All I've seen is that the item has changed rarity, which clearly points to it coming to the item shop soon. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy. And if you haven't, watch my last two videos today. I opened 100 golden moons, and then I traded up a bunch of golden moon items, and we got some pretty good items. And I'd also like to thank Mark Ross. Go and subscribe to Mark Ross's YouTube channel. I'll leave it in the description and the pinned comment because Mark Ross actually pointed out to me that the rarity of this item changed. So he's actually the reason that this was brought to my attention. So there you go, guys. That's it from me. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.